no matter what Gucci done or what he say, y'all owe homage to him. Yeah. I won't give a fuck about anything, dog, for real. And that's a real lion, a real nigga. You feel me? Y'all owe homage to that man. It should be no disrespect because when he disrespects, the hustle guard will take care of him. But y'all, as soldiers coming up in the ranks and doing what y'all doing, holding it down, we don't come from that. I can go on this phone all day and disrespect homeboy if I wanted to and say certain things I want to say. But I don't do it because no matter how much the other niggas he have whatever, saying whatever, or doing whatever to, to slander me or whatever case may be, that's that, Frenchie. And nothing I can say about that. You feel me? Yeah. But I'm always be my who I am when I was when I was raised. You know what I'm saying? What makes me greater? What makes me greater than all these niggas? Cause I got five niggas in me. I'm talking about street niggas in me. That makes me great. What makes me great? I got six myself. You know what I'm saying? I understand. That's an understanding. That's an understanding. You know what I mean? What so, about what about you ever had you ever had a little brother push? Like what about you ever felt the uh what about when I'm not doing the hurt, sometimes I'm hurt. Huh? When, when you like, when you can be, Bim, you can be hurt and push back in a way of, I don't mean to hurt you, but I'm tired. Stop doing that to me. Because you can get on your own. It's, it, it, some people can't ignore, bro. This is the truth, bro. You understand? You, even though it's a tactic for everybody, you know it's a tactic for everybody, Bim. You know that? No, nah, I don't. I don't believe in that. Yeah, like, I, I, don't, I don't. I don't. I don't believe in that, bro. If we, if, 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 the, if, if we avoided, if America avoided everything, we wouldn't have our resources that we have right now to this day, if we avoided everything. So it, it, sometimes you can't avoid everything. You can't. Because when you do... It's, it's not a question... Yo, friends, let me tell you something. It's, it's, not, it's not a question of avoiding. You know what I'm saying? It's, 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 not, it's not a question. It's not a question of avoiding anything because you're not avoiding it. You feel me? I always learned, brother. Who he who run today live to fight another day. This ain't your fight. Your Tupac said, "Nigga, you don't go to war if you get your money right." I got my money right. Now I'm ready to go to war. You know what I'm saying? You don't go to war with niggas that's bad. Yours right now, bro. You can't. You feel me? Because the numbers gonna be out. You no matter all of us gonna die for you. But what you gonna do? Put us in the room to die for you? Now, how much you care for us? For real. How much you care for us? But we're not going to let nothing happen to you. So, what you feel about us? And we know that as, as, as been in warfare a couple of times, we already know the outcome of a lot of things before it happens. You feel me? We know the outcome. We know the outcome. So, why would you put niggas cased up, niggas in jail, niggas dead, Niggas this, that, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? Even with the, the kid, the kid, young chop, you be for what you going at it. For what? So, somebody said 50 proved it. Proved that. <laughs> no, I'm saying. No, these you understand what I'm saying? Like, like for what, bro? For what? <clears throat> you going to take the front line for something that ain't worth nothing? What, what is worth? I mean, real, what is worth? How many niggas we can count on hand right now that Bust they gun that did the craziest shit in the world. Yo, niggas ain't even saluting them no more. Facts. Niggas not even saluting them no more. That shit don't mean nothing. You're right. You know what I'm saying? That shit don't that shit ain't about nothing. You know what I mean? You got niggas out here thinking that New York niggas is soft, niggas ain't shit, niggas ain't got no morals, niggas ain't got no principles. They act like they the only ones with these morals and these principles. Cause you know why? You get on that motherfucker and you start ranting on these niggas, they feel it ain't real. But it's real from your heart. You know it's real. That it can happen. But you wearing your emotions on your sleeve, man, like I told Dev. Yo, you got to stop wearing your emotions on your sleeve, yo. You got to stop. That shit is corny. Me and Walker was on the phone all night last night. Just talking. Just chopping it up. Just going. You feel me? Me and Walker on the phone all night. I'm being real. We just talking. Chopping it up. I told Walker. I said, yo, I'm going to call Frenchie tomorrow, man. I'm going to call him. You know what I mean? Yo, niggas, stick to your grind, man. I listen to these niggas' music. Yo, your music is hot. It's hard. What's the problem? 
Stay grounded. Let that shit speak to these niggas. Not you. You shouldn't be speaking. Let the music speak. Fuck all that shit in there. You've been through too much in your life. More than these niggas. Why are you on there? Why, why are you on there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Doing it, yeah, yo, yo, ooh, ooh, yo, shirt off is my record. Uh, yo, homie, want to do? They pay homage. Let them do it. Don't, don't. That's nothing, man. That's about nothing. Make another one. That's about nothing. That's a fact. You feel me? That's about nothing. So when you, when you, when you, when you, when you talking, oh geez, you gotta talk to the right niggas. You know that. You grew up with all us. You know who's what, what. You know who your father is. A one man army. One man army. Not no crew. One man army. And I can speak on a lot of shit that nigga did to niggas. These niggas look up to. These niggas who say, yeah, nigga. I know a lot of niggas that this nigga, your father, done handled his business, nigga. Ain't nobody go near that nigga. You feel me? Ain't go near him. But these niggas praise these niggas. These niggas praise these niggas. Niggas know who your father is, nigga. And that's a fact. Niggas, I, I don't want to get started. I don't want to get on here and run in my mouth. You feel me? Because it's really going to be a war. You feel me? Because I'm going to let niggas know. Huh? Who fear who? I don't fear no man walking. That's a fact. I wasn't raised that way. That's a fact. I got respect. You got respect. I got respect. Respect but as far as the fear factor, people. nigga, I come from a different cloth than you niggas, man. Mm. Different. Different. You feel me? Grew up I'm made different. I and just for, it's a nigga. I, I'm not even gonna say that, man. It's just it's just for you even being my relative. Like it's not like I, I never, you ain't never speak to me. You spoke to me on on family time, bro. Like family time shit. That just is an honor. And Joe in here too, man. That's my other cousin, man. Like, yeah, Joe, Joe, Joe the boss, man. Other, you know, that's the, yo, Joe. I was on I was on the other line with my man from BK. He talking about um Don and them and Teflon and them. He talking he talking to them, man. We talking about Tef, man. They deported them. You know what I mean? Young niggas, yeah. real niggas, real, real niggas. You feel That's me? Fact. And just to get, just, just queens right now know who you are on the line. Like, a lot of people know who you are on the line, bro. Like, especially for New York. You feel me? It's a total different thing. You know what I'm saying? Like, and niggas like me, like, before you being my cousin, bro, even me, be, if I was just being a regular street nigga in the hood, I would be looking up to you, man. You feel me? It's just coming from the hood. And I watched a lot of, I watched a lot of things that y'all, done like growing up man you know what i'm saying like ambition is what i got from y'all you feel me that's make me go yeah and if they say anything you see i don't never quit i don't never quit with what i'm doing good at what's best you feel me i love music i'm not gonna ever quit music to the i'm just gonna keep going question dz but see see i look at it like this right i look at it like this right and i was gonna talk to you personally about it, whatever like this dude right um this this dude, I hope they do too. This, this dude, right? This 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 young kid, right? He, he he does a lot of talking, right? And you know, like when he was a kid, I bought him sneakers, shoes. I used to bring him money. I used to look out for him. You feel me? Now he gets on the line, talking about his father made flip take the 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 video down. Or whatever he made that call, he put that call in, but nobody put no call in, bro. You feel me? Nobody put no call in. You're 23 years old, bro. You need to go to school and go learn something. You, you're not out in these streets like that. You ain't been out in these streets. You feel me? You ain't been out in these streets. My fight ain't against this little kid. You feel me? It's not against this little kid, man. My fight is the niggas behind him that's gassing a little nigga to run out there and, and, and he get hit by a car. Mm hmm You feel me? Yo, he get hit by a car. You're not schooling him enough. And that's what we talking about, the OGs. Who, what OG you talking about? Because these OGs out here, I couldn't consider them OGs because you wasn't outside when we was outside. Because the niggas out, outside, when I was outside, I was really outside. You ain't hand them on. You ain't, they ain't doing that dumb sucker shit, sending niggas out and do common cause admissions. Because they love their niggas. You feel me? Like I just told you. Don't fuck with these dumb niggas out here because they, they niggas got nothing to live for, bro. How much fun we have with family time? Hmm? We love each other. So why put each other in a line of fire? 
He who runs today lives to fight another day. We're going to put down the vocabulary today for you so you can understand he who runs today lives to fight another day. It don't matter how much they're on their woofing. Okay. Yo, dog, when I got released, when I got released from prison, I was going to get released. And this nigga named Tracy, I'll never forget this nigga, big nigga. He tried to start something with me on the walkway. I can't hear you, Frenchie. Can't hear you. I, I can't, uh, I can't. All right. He tried to start something on the walkway with me. Nigga called me a bitch. 